Ripple, a provider of blockchain-based solutions, has released its Ripple CBDC platform, an end-to-end -end solution allowing governments, financial institutions, and central banks to create and issue their own central bank digital currency. Stay with me until the conclusion, and we'll go over everything it implies. If this is something that interests you, I highly recommend watching this brand new video right now. Welcome to our channel, where we discuss recent developments involving XRP and the cryptocurrency industry at large. Ripple is a cryptocurrency solutions provider that is revolutionizing the way money is transferred, stored, and tokenized around the globe. As an alternative to the current quo, Ripple's business solutions are quicker, more transparent, and more cost-effective. And we find application cases where crypto technology can inspire new business models and offer opportunity for more people, together with our partners and the greater development community. By utilizing carbon-free blockchain technology and a green digital asset like XRP, we are able to bring about a more sustainable global economy and planet with every solution we implement. Our goal is to create crypto solutions for a global economy, and here is how we plan to get there. The XRP ledger is managed by a distributed group of programmers all around the world and is open source, public, and a layer one blockchain. It is quick, uses little power, and can be relied upon. It has been the blockchain of choice for facilitating the widespread settlement and liquidity of tokenized assets for almost a decade. With a supportive community, simple development processes, and cheap transaction costs. Without compromising the XRP Hill's minimal and efficient feature set, it enables developers with a solid open source base on which to execute the most demanding projects. Payments, distributed accounting, and tokenization are just a few of the many services and use cases made possible by XRPL. When a country central bank issues its own digital money, it is called a central bank digital currency. They function similarly to digital currencies, but their value is pegged to the national fiat currency by the central bank. A large number of nations are working on CBDCs, and some have even started using them. Considering the number of nations investigating digital currency conversion methods. Knowing what they are and what they imply for society is crucial. Fiat money is currency issued by a government but not backed by a commodity such as gold or silver. It can be used as payment for goods and services just like any other legal tender. Banknotes and coins were the traditional forms of fiat currency, but the advent of modern technology has allowed governments and banks to augment banknotes and coins with a credit-based model that keeps track of balances and transactions electronically. In addition, more than 90% of countries are investigating, developing, and deploying central bank digital currencies to broaden access to banking services and reduce the expense and risk associated with domestic and international money transfers. Now, the company has announced the Ripple CBDC platform, which provides a turnkey, hassle-free option for governments, financial institutions, and central banks to launch their own digital currencies. The new and improved platform will enable users to fully manage and personalize the whole lifespan of fiat-based central bank digital currency, transaction, and distribution by harnessing the power of the same blockchain technology utilized on the XRP ledger. The blockchain technology powering the XRP ledger is also utilized by the Ripple CBDC platform. The XRPL technology will allow users to oversee and modify the full transaction and distribution cycle of a fiat-based CBDC. The platform will also facilitate the management and participation of interinstitutional settlement and distribution functions for CBDC held by financial institutions. As a trusted partner to multiple central banks, James Wallace, Vice President of Central Bank Engagements and CBDCs, believes this platform will enable many central banks and governments devise plans and establish a technological strategy for CBDC implementations. The platform's cutting-edge features will facilitate the immediate settlement of domestic and international payments, lessen the potential for fraud, and enhance the convenience of sending and receiving digital money. While it's being carried on. Don't miss out on being the first to know what's going on with XRP. Subscribe to our channel and enable push notifications now. 
The Atlantic Council reports that 11 nations have implemented a national digital currency system, with China's test program expected to be rolled out across the country by 2023. An additional 112 nations, representing 95% of global GDP, are investigating how to introduce a CBDC. In an interview with the Reserve Bank of India RBI, Julia Diamond over from FIS, a fintech company enabling nations to become digital, first real-time economies, urged stakeholders to keep up with the development of real-time payments and the expanding function of digital assets, such as CBDC Suraj. President of the Republic of Palau Gil Whips, Jr. expressed excitement with the debut of the site. Developed to address multiple use cases, such as wholesale and retail CBDCs on a private ledger or issuing a stable coin, the partnership with Ripple to create our national digital currency is part of our commitment to lead in the area of financial innovation and technology, he said, giving the people of Folo greater access to the financial system. Ledger technology is provided to users of the Ripple CBDC platform, which is supported by the XRP blockchain. The CBDC platform is founded on a new private ledger supported by the XRP ELS Core Energy Efficient Technology Issuer, allowing issuers like central banks, monetary authorities, or commercial banks to manage the full life cycle of their fiat-based digital currency, from minting and distribution to redemption and destruction, in a highly secure manner by leveraging the XRP ledger's built-in multi-signing capabilities. Because of this, operators can oversee and take part in the interinstitutional settlement and distribution functions involving the digital money. Users of digital currencies, including businesses and consumers, will have a safe place to store their currency, as well as the ability to utilize it to make and receive purchases. In the same way that existing banking and payment apps do today, including support for transactions that don't require a network connection or a smartphone. Recently, Juniper Research placed Ripple CBDC solutions at the top of their competitive leaderboard. Among a list of 15 CBDC technology suppliers, Ripple topped the chart. CB Insights named Ripple the best blockchain company for CBDCs and cross-border payments. One of the most valuable tokens in the cryptocurrency market is XRP. Ripple XRP can now also be called the world's reserve currency. This is the claim of a theory proposed by Jimmy Valley. It was in 2021 that Valley, managing director of Val Hill Capital, proposed the XRP buyback theory, which was disproven in late 2022. Like other digital currencies, XRP can be traded or invested in in the same ways. The Ripple network might potentially be used to conduct other kinds of transactions, such as currency exchanges. As an alternative to going via a bank or currency exchange to convert your Indian rupees to euros, you might convert your INR to XRP on the Ripple network and then use those XRP to purchase euros. When compared to the large costs banks and money remittance businesses may impose, this option can be more faster and cheaper. Before I go any further, I'd like to enlighten you on the Expo. A market maker is an independent liquidity provider. It's analogous to a user lending. Their crypto assets to a platform so that trade in cryptocurrencies can be further decentralized. If you use Dexbull, you can earn incentives from the fees earned by transactions on the platform, which many people see as a sort of passive income. It's worth emphasizing that anyone can provide funds for use on decentralized platforms like Uniswap, SushiSwap, etc. SpindleD, if you sign up for Dixwell through the link in the video description, you'll be eligible for a special bonus. You can earn up to 100 XRP with this offer. An additional 10 days of access to cash. This incentive is only available to new players who make a deposit. And now, the answer to the question that has everyone speculating, will XRP be the reserve currency of the digital world? Having spent a good deal of time in the Bitcoin industry, I can attest to the fact that both proponents and detractors of this idea exist. If ever there were a candidate for a global reserve currency, it would be XRP. It's easily stored in large numbers, making it useful for everything from foreign exchange reserves to international transactions to investments. A total of 100 billion XRP were generated throughout its development. 
Let's start with a definition of a reserve currency. Basically, it's a money that is recognized everywhere and is used as a safe haven by governments and businesses alike. The US dollar is the de facto reserve currency of the international community. However, in recent years, it has been debated whether the Chinese yuan or the euro may replace the dollar in this function. Now, regarding XRP, there are others who think it has the potential to compete with established reserve currencies. One piece of evidence in favor of this hypothesis, the fact that XRP is being widely used in the financial sector is the Ripple, the firm behind XRP, has formed strategic alliances with numerous financial institutions and payment processors. Furthermore, the XRP technology enables instant, low-cost international payments. This can make it a viable alternative to traditional wire transfers for governments looking to lessen their reliance on reserve currency and cut costs. But there are also concerns raised about XRP's potential role as a reserve currency. The fact that it hasn't yet gained widespread recognition outside the cryptocurrency industry is a big cause for concern. While more and more banks are starting to embrace it, consumers and small companies have been slow to catch on. Furthermore, it is unclear how XRP would be governed if it were to become a reserve currency. Because of the widespread perception that cryptocurrencies pose a danger to established financial institutions, governments, and central banks could be hesitant to give one such a prominent role. The future of XRP status as a reserve currency is uncertain, and there are valid arguments for and against this development. Time is required, like with any new technology, to observe its development and adoption by many parties. The present acceptance and technological capabilities of XRP make it an interesting candidate for the digital world reserve currency. In conclusion, XRP could be worth investing in if you think that the Ripple payment system will ultimately be successful. Only risk what you can comfortably afford to lose. This video has reached its conclusion, viewers who have found it entertaining should give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to sign up. See you in the next one, bye.